happening today. The sister of the two Indianapolis teenagers kidnapped from their home last week, sparking an Amber Alert, makes her initial appearance before a judge today. During a hearing, a judge could decide whether to allow Whitney Blackwell to bond out of jail. That's where she's been the last week and where she says she feels the safest right now. Our reporter Ann Kelly joins us live downtown to explain. Ann? Hey, good morning, Mark and Beth. Well, I'm live outside the city county building where 27 year old Whitney Blackwell will have her first court appearance at 9 a.m. Uh, in just a little bit. Now, since last Monday, when she was taken into custody after a traffic stop for driving under a suspended license, she has been here downtown being held at the Marion County Jail, also for drug trafficking charges awaiting this hearing. And she's told RTV6 also fearing for her life. Again, she is the older sister of 16 year old Aaron and 13 year old Emma Blackwell, who were abducted. One week ago today and have since been returned to their home safely. Now, Whitney has said it was her ex boyfriend who was behind the abduction that he is retaliating because she admits she stole $120,000 worth of drug money from, from him as well as some drugs. So, quite simply, she fears if she leaves jail, she will be killed, even though her ex boyfriend has been arrested along with five other people in connection to that abduction last week. So, a lot of layers to this case, but today, the focus this 27 year old woman and the potential laws she has broken. Again, Whitney Blackwell in court today facing charges, uh, drug trafficking charges and charges for driving under uh, driving on a suspended license. For now, we're reporting live downtown. Ann Kelly, RTV6.